Morning. Morning, gang. Matt from the Southwest Backpacker Channel. And I've got Terry with me today. Morning, YouTubers. Good morning. We are here in Moab, Utah, and we're heading over to Texas Riverways. We're going to sign in and uh, get the boat unloaded and get all of our gear off the car here and into their gear wagon. They're going to boat us down to Crystal Geyser, which is our put-in at the Green River. So uh, stay tuned. Should be a epic trip for sure. Thumbs up. Left at the Denny's. Left at Denny's. Hey guys, we're here at uh, Texas Riverways and they're getting the uh, gear boat here ready to go. And we're going to load this guy up with all of our gear and uh, all of our boats and gear right here. We're going to load it up onto one of these trailers. And we're uh, just moments away from heading down to the Green River, putting in a Crystal Geyser. Stay tuned. Thumbs up. So we just got down here to Crystal Geyser and we're unloading the boats and the gear. It is uh, about uh, 1030. It's a nice, uh, good timing this morning. Nice, calm, clear morning with no wind, and the water's looking good. Thumbs up. Here is uh, Crystal Geyser, all this mineral outflow, and uh, this is actually a cold water geyser that was drilled down, and uh, must have hit a water table down at some point and back in the day this thing used to gush out pretty pretty tall I think it just only comes out uh, half a foot to a foot nowadays but um, it's got some really cool mineral deposits that outflow right up to the edge of the Green River here Okay, so we are in the water. We have just getting ready to shove off here from shore. Voila. Uh, Swing us around. You guys can see the other boat, Alex and Sean in the back there passing by. around here and show you what it looks like downriver. So we're not even uh, maybe 15 minutes in and you guys can see downriver there. We got some rapids. So uh, we're gonna have to navigate this and check this out. We're good. I think if as long as we stay on the right, like you were saying, 
we're kind of just coasting it as long as we keep it straight. That was too easy, dude. I think Cataract Canyon, <laughs> our next big thrill seeker. Okay, we've been about an hour into the trip and uh, we've reached our first uh, layer of uh, cliffs. Not sure what type of layer this is, uh, but we're now starting to get into some of the canyon features here, which is really cool. Okay, so what do we got here? I think it is five minutes till four o'clock. We just pulled off the water. It's feeling pretty hot. I'm guessing it's probably around 92 degrees. And we found a really nice spot off the water here. We, uh, we saw this little cottonwood tree, or I should say big cottonwood tree, and thought that might uh, offer a really good shade area and a camp spot and uh, climbed up there sure enough it's a great spot so pretty easy access right down to the water here and so we're going to call this our uh, camp spot for day one we are just on the other side of anvil bottom and the big anvil, or inkwell I should say, is uh, that feature right there. It doesn't look like it from this side, but as we pass by it and look back, you'll get a better, uh, a better view of what it looks like. Okay, we've got a nice little camp set up underneath this uh, nice cottonwood tree here that's been providing shade for us. It is uh, about 6.17 and we're off the water, we're watching the sun go down and uh, yeah, this has uh, sort of been our hangout spot in the shade and uh, we've been migrating down to the river, it's a little bit cooler down here and we're going to get an epic uh, sunset watching the sun go down reflecting off these sandstone cliffs up here. This feature right here is called the anvil or the inkwell and uh, sort of represents an old inkwell that you would see back in the 1920s or something you know where you dip a feather or something into an ink, ink jar, inkwell. Uh, as we pass by it tomorrow and you'll get a much better view of it as we look behind but uh, this is where we're camped at and uh, we're gonna camp right here on the beach tonight just lay out a tarp throw down the sleeping bags call it good no tent sleep under the stars tonight thumbs up